time of the year to show love and have fun. It brings Christians and non-Christians together to celebrate the birth of Jesus Christ all over the world. In Nigeria, Christmas holiday brings people from within and outside the country together to bond with family and friends. However, in celebrating the day, some Nigerians attended special services at their churches, while others stayed at home to enjoy the holiday with family and friends. The cinemas, amusement park, and other fun places such as the beach provided fun to make the festival an unforgettable moment with loved ones. While Christmas is expected to be filled with lots of fun, some fun seekers in Lagos claim this year's experience is less exciting. They say the country is presently faced with so much economic challenges, discouraging many from celebrating as they wish to. The previous Christmas that I've, that I've experienced, I think they are much more better than this one uh, compared with what is happening in the country. For scarcity, the economy, the hardship. People just, with what I read, I wasn't here last year, but I was told the crowd that invaded here last year, they are much more than what we have now. So I think the economy really is not really encouraging uh, for people to really celebrate the Christmas. I just came to have fun with my children. Um, last year I was not able to come here because I traveled. But the fun over there and here is quite okay. So I'm enjoying myself with the family. For some businessmen and women who manage to visit few fun places with their loved ones, they say their high expectation of this year's celebration turned out disappointing as they couldn't have their desired fun due to the change in price of the services rendered at fun spots. We expected to have enough fun to ride on halls and uh, buy more things, but we find out that the whole thing is on high side. Even coming down to this place, the cab, as at last year, with, uh, the cab was 3000 but today we pay the driver 6000 everything is just on high side. But we don't have choice, we just have to celebrate life, we just have to be happy. Last year on is better than this year on, because everything cost. This, I was here last year, the cost of things this year is higher than that of last year. You understand? And the population here is totally reduced. Last year, if you come here, you will not see space to sit. A lot of people full everywhere. But this year, as you can see, there's a little bit scanty. So because of the cost of living, many people cannot afford to come here this year. While comparing the previous Christmas season, fun seekers say prices of things have skyrocketed due to the fluctuating scarcity of fuel. And these, they believed, resulted in the low turnout of people at fun spots this year as not so many can afford what they could last year. Economic is not speak very well. So compared to last year, at least we don't have challenges of fuel for, for, for last year. But this year is very terrible. Before I came here, I went to Philly to go and get fuel. I can able to get fuel 250 per liter because I don't want to stress myself because I can see the way people are killed fighting before they can get fuel. On getting here, spend a lot of money compared to last year because I know the amount I spent, let's say, before I can enter this place. So, but this year is very terrible. Even here that we sat down, that they came to come and harass us that we must come into their bar before we can entertain ourselves. So we have to tell them that we we avoid this exhaust all the money that we brought here. So they now say we should remove our tent and the chair. We should put it aside before we can able to do anything. So well, it's not, it's not easy, Sha, because this crowd is not like this last year. By this time around, at least, that is, in fact, this place was choked last year, but this year is, at least, I think it's economy that is affected, Sha. In the spirit of Christmas, many Nigerians have put aside the uncertainty that lies ahead, keeping alive their holiday chair, anxious and yet hopeful that the coming elections might mark a favorable turn in the economy. Mary Ahidelo.
Arise News Lagos.